Well, I definitely managed to fry Mark II. Look at all those pretty colors. So I had just started another batch of broccoli seeds, which were starting to look pretty good. And then the tubing came off here. So this had disconnected, which now with as hard as it's on there, I'm not sure how, but it had disconnected like that. And so then when the water was getting pumped through, it started pushing it underneath of the cover and pushed it into the next cavity over. It completely flooded this entire area. So I unplugged everything as quick as I could and pulled out the electronics, but it was very dead. <laughs> so I ended up leaving the water in the container and waiting for the electronics to dry out. So then a couple hours later, I came back down and all of a sudden I heard some drip, drip, drip. So I think what happened is there's a tiny parting line right here where I joined the two pieces together that I didn't watertight seal because obviously no water is supposed to actually get over here. And I think it dripped and leaked through the part itself and then leaked out onto my desk which of course then leaked through the outlet. So that was a little bit worrisome. Not only that, it dripped down underneath my desk onto the CNC machine. So that means I'm gonna take a completely different tact with Mark III. I think I wanted to try and do uh, an NFT, not the, the digital cryptocurrency stuff. Now the uh, nutrient film technique. So I was already having issues with these brass nozzles. Uh, I had let this sit for a while. And when I came back to it, every one of these were clogged up. Uh, I think the trying to push nutrients through them, uh, it kind of like calcified or something in here. Uh, so that's kind of a, a bummer to be, just let it sit and then it kills these off each time. They're not like crazy expensive or anything, but that's still an annoyance. So I'm gonna try a much smaller uh, build here and still using the same water pump and the same electronics, I think, uh, but without doing the misting and just letting the water ride down along underneath of the roots. Uh, so we'll give that a shot. So I'll let you know how the updates go and until next time.